With rising costs, buy now, pay later options are surging. It's especially tempting for families as students get ready to head back to school. Tonight, Michelle Lee looks at the pros and cons. This was my first buy now, pay later purchase. So buy now, pay later is exactly how it sounds. A temptation that even attorney Cherie Davis can't always refuse. So it really is like the modern day layaway, but just you get the gratification. You get instantly. everything up front. <laughs> you get everything before you pay. Cherie always reads the fine print, and though at times she's pampered herself, she actually uses it more to pay for unplanned family expenses. It's appropriate for the times. Like, people are crunching numbers every day. In fact, some stores, like Walmart, even allow people to shop for groceries with Buy Now, Pay Later. As a financial expert, I am sympathetic to people's financial situations. Still, Dion Motley of Legacy Changers Academy says there are other options that she'd prefer over buy now pay later, including saving, budgeting, and even credit cards with rewards. If you have the option to get a credit card that will allow for you to make the purchase, and as you're making the payments, you are able to build your credit, that's going to be a better option for you. Cherie is actually one of Dion's clients, and they've come to an agreement on how buy now pay later can work for her. Cherie's technically budgeting by allowing herself to spend a small amount per pay period for a short amount of time. I usually try to keep it under like $60 per payment. That means she'll use buy now, pay later to make smaller purchases once it can be paid off in two or three payments rather than just spending two or $300 at once. I started reading. I was like, oh, they're not going to do a hard inquiry. You know, there's no interest and I get these four payments and, you know, I was like, why not? Do you do buy now, pay later? Absolutely not. <laughs> That's what I thought. <laughs> Absolutely not. And again, I'm not against it. I'm sympathetic to people's financial situations. Um, I would prefer to use a credit card that gives me cash back, rewards, travel rewards, whatever the case may be. But I'm also an advocate and an, an, a practicer of budgeting. For our mom and attorney, Cherie, buy now, pay later gives her a mix of both. It's needed. It's appropriate where people can get the things that they need and they can control, you know, like the payment and the commitment and then you don't have to jump over a bunch of hurdles to get access to it. Michelle Lee, five on your side. And we have more financial do's and don'ts at kstk.com slash money.